We're here with Ranjani Balakrishnan and we're going to talk today about intent-driven autonomous networks. So Ranjani, what have you got for us today? So today I'm going to talk to you about how AI-enabled OSS BSS is going to help you take the leap towards adaptive autonomy through the implementation of intent management. So what is intent then? When we talk about intent, we're talking not only about the business objectives of the consumers and the enterprise customers, but also the CSPs. So it's important to understand the business objectives and handle the intent coming from these different parties and enable these intents to then be translated as network resource configurations. And this translation is going to happen across different layers. We have the business autonomous domain and the end-to-end -end service autonomous domains with this multi-domain service orchestration, wherein we are connecting business goals with network capabilities for both differentiated connectivity and scaling. And we also have the resource layer then, which is focusing on network resource optimization. So in this particular demo showcase, we're going to be focusing on the core commerce layer in the business autonomous domain. We're also going to be talking about charging and billing evolved, which enables real time charging for any service, any segment at any time at scale. And when it comes to the service layer, we're talking about multi-domain service orchestration and assurance, which also does multi-vendor orchestration. So in this demo, basically, we're going to talk about the end-to-end -end OSS BSS realization of sell, deliver, and get paid. So we're going to enable our CSPs to design products efficiently by communicating their business needs towards an intelligent assistant, which then translates it into actionable building blocks in the system. So all the product managers have to do about now is think about business strategies and not worry about the technical complexities in terms of implementation. And once you've designed the products that you would like to sell for such immersive experiences, you're then going to be selling it to the people that are going to buy and use these differentiated connectivity based services. So here we are trying to accelerate the sales process through guided selling through an efficient configure price and quote. And once you've designed, sold, you need to deliver as fast as you've been able to sell. So that's where we have intent driven service orchestration that does multi domain service orchestration. The intent is now decomposed from the business layer to the service layer. So you've orchestrated, provisioned, fulfilled, activated these uh, differentiated connectivity based services. And once people have started using these services, you need to assure guaranteed performance levels that people have paid for. So they've paid for a superior service experience. It's the responsibility of the CSP to then deliver on that. So we enable that through cognitive loop based closed loop automation. We have it powered with agentic AI. So you have you know, multiple agents working in tandem to observe if everything is going as it should in the network, you know, predictively indicate if some degradation is likely to happen, then do a quick root cause analysis, propose remedial actions, evaluate which remedial action is best suited based on simulations, and then finally actuate it in the system to prevent the service degradation preemptively. So you have a complete closed loop automation, and then the network operations engineer just has to talk to the network to understand more if you know, he or she chooses to. So you've designed, you've sold, you've orchestrated, you've assured, and then it's all about making money. So real-time monetization, real-time partner settlement, and enabling all of this at scale. That's what this is all about. Anjani, thank you for the insights.